Hello, this is Derek Kern with Kern Electronics and Lasers. Today we'll be etching a piece of marble with a picture of uh, Brad Pitt and Angelina Jolie. Here's the photo I found on the internet. Just a colored JPEG. We'll open up our Photograph software and open up that JPEG from our desktop. The next step will be to select the material that we're going to use, which will be black marble. We'll hit the select material and scroll down and find that black marble. There we are. Hit OK. Next, we're going to resize our image and select the DPI we're going to use. 600 DPI works nice on black marble, and we'll resize it to 12 inches. We hit OK. The computer just takes a few seconds here to resize it. The next step that we'll be doing is the final process. Just a few seconds. There we are. And once we hit the final process button, what this does is it dithers the image into black and white dots, and it will look nice on the piece of marble. Today we'll be etching this photo with a high speed engraving laser system. That's a Kern HSE 150 watt system. We'll be etching it at about 150 inches per second at 600 DPI. We'll just give this a few seconds to finish the dithering process. And then we'll save this file onto our desktop. It's a TIFF file. Just a couple more seconds here and it should be done. Once this is done processing, it's going to give us a preview of what the file will look like on the piece of stone. There you go. That's what it will look like on the black marble. We'll etch it white. Next, we can go to Save Image and save it as an engraved image onto our desktop. And that will save the TIFF file onto our desktop. Next, we're going to open up that image. Here it is, the TIFF file, with our CorelDRAW software. We'll wait for CorelDRAW to open up. And we're going to import the TIFF into CorelDRAW and get the file set up onto the table. You can see here we have a new CorelDRAW screen. We're going to go to File and New and adjust our table size to 52 inches by 100 inches, which is the table that we'll be engraving on today. And we'll import that TIFF file onto the table. There it is. And we can just click anywhere inside the rectangle which represents our table. And we'll drag this to the front of the system. You can see the dithering process, how it looks a little bit weird right now, but I assure you that it will turn out nice on the laser or on the piece of marble. We'll drag that, that photo to the front of the table and make a 12-inch border around it. This border will we'll cut this out of the paper so we know exactly where to place our piece of stone. And now we can save that as a CDR file and Put it on a zip drive and bring it out to the laser. And we'll see you out at the laser system. We're out at the laser now. And you can see I opened up the CorelDRAW file that we just made with the dithered image. We're going to print this over to the laser by going to File and Print. And we'll use the printer driver, the current EMF printer driver, to print that file over to the laser. You can see the converting box. Well, now we're going to set some settings now. We're going to set up. 
in the image settings tab, we'll set our engraving power at 75% and our speed at 150 inches per second. And we'll cut out that border at 3 inches per second and about 10% powder. You can now open up the cut screen and hit continue. And you can see I've already cut out the border file where we're going to place the stone. I'll just cut it out once more here to show you what I've done. I've cut out the paper here, the 12 by 12 square where that piece of stone is going to lay. And once we get that cut out, we can take our natural stone, their 12 inch by 12 inch blank absolute black marble pieces, and we can position that in the cutout. See, nice and black. And we'll place that on the laser bed, get it squared up and ready to engrave. Once it's positioned, we can turn on the engraving checkbox in the KCAM software and hit continue. See, engrave image file needs to be checked as we just got done cutting it out. It's going to come to the front of the file and start etching. Line by line. 600 passes every inch. You can see it's just starting on the bottom of the marble there, just starting to etch it. It's going to etch it a nice frosty white color. show you the whole system view and what I'll do is I'm gonna zoom in on this piece of marble and I'll fast forward a little bit to the end so you can see exactly what this piece is gonna look like We're just finishing up our file here. You can start to see the faces and bodies of the of Brad and Angelina. Try to get that glare out of there. Let me reposition. There we go. Nice crisp etching on black marble done with the Kern HSE laser system. Really not too much to it. Just get your file, process it in Photograve, position it on the table, send it to the laser, set your power settings, and let the laser do the rest.